What up, what up, what up? Bankroll 10, bet it up. Been, what? 10, 12 days, some shit like that. I can put up a video. Like I said, I haven't had storage on my phone to do it. I don't even know how long this video will go. But anyways, Monte Carlo is done, been done, gone. If you guys see the IG reels, I'll put it on there. But uh, did not get a chance to fab this yet, but it is going to get done. The Chevelle ended up destroying the whole center section and destroyed the cover too. So this is an older model true track setup that was in this car from the beginning. So I never set any of this. This was, all I had to do was pull the center out to put my bar in the rear end and narrow it. So the gear was set right. There's no sharp edges, nothing, but now it's junk because you know, it came apart. This old uh, true track style right here was only held together by four bolts. The new, which all four of them snapped off, and that was the weak spot part of that. This is the new one, which is the new true track. You guys can see my marks on there, doing the grease line up, all that. But anyway, it's got six bolts on this side and the inside, and six bolts on this side and the inside behind here, not just three bolts. So now that's the obviously newer, better, it's a true track top of the line shit boom this is a 12 bolt so the car is strong it does have a lot of horsepower uh 12 bolt is basically 8.8 .8. plenty of cars out there with that much horsepower this much horsepower and these rear ends staying together you don't technically have to have a nine inch rear end if you would have had a nine inch yeah this would have probably never happened but that was a setup that was in the car that's what we worked with it's all fabbed up um but real fast did that. Had to knock all the races out of the housing, all that. Uh, put all the new bearings and all that shit in. Set the backlash. Backlash took me a little bit. When you buy the gears, they have a booklet in there and it shows you acceptable wear patterns and all that. It tells you if you're too much pinion, not enough pinion, shim, shit like that. Then you got your competition mode, which is the top right. So competition mode, if you were to look at this, and look at, I'm trying not to block the light. You would see that's competition mode. Got the eight to ten thousandths backlash. Uh, but anyways, so 